Franklin and Michael has a mission up there for us. So we're gonna scoot on that way. So I just want to say, guys, I appreciate all the support. Got a few more subscribers over the last few days, and uh, we really appreciate that. We're looking to turn this into something good for you guys. We like the entertaining and showing people new games, going through the stories, all that good stuff. So I hope you guys are going to stick with us for this journey because we're going to keep it going. Uh-oh, phone call. What's up, Lamar? What's up, homie? Hey, look. Chop got to stay around your crib for a while, homie. That's cool? Yeah, man, it's cool. Shit's the best place for him anyway. Ha! <laughs> Like it ain't nobody out there gunning for your black ass. Bullshit, nigga. Just take care of it, man, all right? All right, I got you, dog. Okay, guys, so I went ahead and skipped ahead to get here to Michael's house. Didn't miss anything, just a bunch of driving. So let's see what Michael's got going on. It's always interesting at Mikey's house. Mikey's chilling by the... Uh-oh. What do you want? Man, I'll come by for that drink you offered, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. Okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look, I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years. And I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> You look like a good kid. But if you want my advice, give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe, just maybe if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Then you're gonna rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like, when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? What you saw the other day was a guy dealing with pests. I guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well, and today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? Nothing. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot. Who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that. I tell you what. <sighs> Least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. <sighs> it's not too far from here. Let's go. Alright, man. I'm following you. <sighs> Let's take Amanda's car. Don't you love how this game transitions from one character to the next? That's it's beautiful how Rockstar did hey, this. Jim, Let's see what I'm going for a drink, Dad, with... shit! I mean our boat going down the western highway! It's it's been stolen! What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it! I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it, they just want to take it! I'm hiding in the head! You're insane! All right, I'm coming. For my boat! All righty then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. Hey, I'll help you out. Well, let's roll then. <clears throat> Tell you what, my kid tried to sell my boat, and that is his ass. Lesson number one. Don't ever have kids. There you go. Let's get this music off her. 
is, I don't think no parenting issues will arise over who had both privileges and who don't. Shit, motherfuckers will be lucky to sit in the bathtub. Shit, things that desperate, huh? Nah, but, you know, shit, I was making a point. Pathologizing self-deprecation. I know it well. Yeah, man, but shit, where the boat at? Little shit's been hijacked. They're somewhere on the Western Highway. Man, ain't you worried? About my boat? Yeah, I am. But you can always buy another boat. Yeah, tell my accountant that. Man, you can always get credit for one. But have you come repo it? No, thank you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I ain't your homie. I'm someone you want to impress. Really? Man, I thought you was retired. Why the fuck do I want to impress some slipper wearing motherfucker? Because I can still teach you a thing or two. Oh shit! I was not watching what I was doing, guys. Yo, both in a fucking hurry, man. Yeah. Well, All right, okay. we got it. We got a plan. Sure. Once I get us up close, <laughs> you're the boarding party. More like the falling in traffic party. You'll be fine. Anything happens, I got a piece of the glove box. I'll cover you. Oh yeah, man. Fine. Just fucking. <clears throat> so you thought of everything, right? Well, you said you want to learn the old way of doing things. This is the old way. Hey, you want me to do this? So we gotta get Franklin up here to get on top of this boat. Come on, Franklin. Get your ass up there. Oh. Oh. Come on, come on, come on. Do what you do, Franklin. Get him. Get off of him! There you go. Hey, stop throwing assholes at me! You're screwing with the wrong retiree! Hey, you asshole! Hey, ain't you covering me? Hey, shoot this motherfucker! Oh, shit. I suck. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Headshot on that ass. Yep, yeah. and it's a long story, bro. Jimmy! No, no, no! Whoa, whoa, Jimmy! Fuck! Hold on! I get him! I got this! Here we go! Oh shit! Oh! I got you, bud! I got you! Here we go! Here we go! Come on! I had it! I had it! Here, now get down here. What the hell? Get there. Oh, damn. Don't me, you little Oh. Come on, Franklin. There we go. All the fucking board. Let's stop this ship from sailing. Now that doesn't sound good. Hey, no, it don't. Man, we ain't chasing shit in this thing. Don't break that. Damn, what is it, a Ford? <laughs> My fucking boat. Hey, it's just. Wants us to go to Los Santos. Hey, there's a chop shop back there, dog. You drive us there, we can get the ride fixed. My boat. It's just a thing. My boat. Please stop doing that. Listen, I fucked up, okay? I'm not going to lie. That was a really bad judgment call. But shit, Dad, I nearly died. And all you give a shit about is this fucking boat. No, it's not that. It's all we do is scream at each other. No wonder I can't get a job. It's all your fucking fault. Or it's not, but it's partly your fault. I, I mean, I just want to impress you. By selling my boat to some gangbangers? 
I know it sounds dumb when you put it like that, but all you do is daydream or get angry. Look, I love you, Jimmy, but you're an asshole. And right now, with my boat disappearing over the horizon, that's all I can see. Franklin, could you do me a favor and give this kid a ride home after they fix this thing? I want to headbutt the road in peace. Oh, great! Leave me with the home invader! I'll get it done, dawg. No problem. Dad! Enough! All right? Enough! Franklin, do me a favor. Call me a taxi, will you? No problem! Hey! I need a cab as soon as you can send one. Los Santos Customs, by the airport. All right, thanks. Thank you. Hey, so you, uh, do much yachting? Not anymore. No, I don't. Before, I mean, man. No, no, not really. This little shit stays in his room all day, and I don't have any other people to go with, you know? I like looking at it. Looking? Yeah. You know, I come down to the marina, sit on the dock, pour myself a drink, and look at it. Jacqueline. Did it clear my head, you know? Let me dream. Jacqueline, huh? Well, maybe you need to do some other shit to fill your time. Dream other dreams, man. Yeah, sure. Whatever. All right, guys, so we're on our way to Los Santos Customs. I'll tell you, I've been playing the online mode as well a little bit, and I'm going to start getting some more of them videos out there. But it seems to me, I don't know, maybe it's just me. But unless you got a crew to run with, it's really hard to get a game together in that online. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Leave a comment and let me know. So you sure you're good? Yeah, I got this. Ooh, I'm going to come up front. Get out and walk around. It's okay, I can just climb over. Look, man, I'm gonna get the ride fixed, man. They dropped it back off at your house along with this dude. It's all good, though, man. You go and get your head right, all right? All right, listen, thanks for today. I appreciate it. You stop back out to the house, we'll talk. Ugh, you see? The show, man. Hey, sorry we didn't get your boat, man. Yeah. Come on, man, let's trick this whip, homie. What the hell? Slap that dude. Repair, respray, and customize. <clears throat> I gotta say, guys, this is probably one of my favorite parts of the game now. I always thought Saints Row had an edge up on Grand Theft Auto, specifically because of the car saving system and customization. But Grand Theft Auto has finally got it right. Need to get you out for one of the races, Franklin. See if you drive as fast as you talk. All right, we get free vehicle repair. And what, we're gonna respray it, I guess? Like the sickest ride that's even conceivable. Let's go metallic. Uh oh, we got to do it, guys. We got to do it. What was that, metallic? Bam! Had to do it. Mom sees a new paint job, she's gonna flip. Take it easy. Oh yeah. I'm not a big auto save. Um no. Yes, I'm sure. So I've never really been a fan of the right, pink, but that's that's pretty sweet. On a credit for our guy, the home invader. You know what? Call me what you like, man. Yeah, I, I, no, I, I mean, sure. Oh, oh, oh. Or James. Jimmy. Or just like, Jizzle? <laughs> no, man. I no. Stick with Jimmy, homie. Don't let it, don't ever say that. What's the deal, man? Huh? You and my old man, I see you at the dealership, and someone steals my whip, and Papa's all like, he's been down there to talk to you guys. Your pops did more than talk. What'd he do? Oh! I ain't gonna tell you, but I lost my fucking job, and I thought maybe he could help me find a new one. Dude, my dad is retired. Like, fully? Like, his only marketable skills are watching TV and daytime drinking. Man, look, I don't know. That's two pretty good skills. Okay to me. Shit, he saved your ass. You saved my ass. Nah, nah, man. Well, 
Well, maybe we good together, you know? Like, maybe we can get shit done we couldn't do separate. If keeps him out of the house, that's cool by me. Yeah, well, we'll see. Look, I'm sorry my dad lost to your job. It's hard out there. Tough. I mean, I'm employmentally challenged. That is so sick. It's more fun to use Franklin specifically for that. Oh! You got fired. Whoa! Damn, that's rough. Not fired as such. I, I didn't get it. Look good all the way to the end, guys. You've been putting your resumes out there, but no one's hiring, huh? No, I, uh, I didn't get a job. I've never had a job. Yo, so like, since we're both unemployed, like, we could run together, you know? Yeah, I think about it, homie. Or, or we could just like shop it, you know, play darts or get our drink on, strip clubs. Come on, dude, I get real crazy. Yeah, I got your number, shit. I need it, man. But uh, hey, hey, you know what? Man, go easy on your pops, dog. All right? All right, church. <laughs> exactly, man. My brother from another mother. I mean, I, I hope this so dude. My mom was kind of a skank back in the day. See ya. I hope he turns out to be a better character. Trey now, like slap the hell out of him. All right, guys, so that is a mission down. And we're going to close this video right here. Uh, just remember to subscribe so you don't miss any of these episodes. It's going to be a long one. Great journey.